guys and welcome back to my channel and if you're new here my name is Courtney and welcome so today I am so excited because I have a little bit of a small haul for you it is only a few products but for me I'm quite excited about it and I thought I'd share it with you before we get started please remember to please subscribe down below and hit thumbs up button ready if you want to see more hauls from me and without further ado let's get into the video my package came today and I had to get on here right away so I could show you guys because I won't open it like I said it's a bit of a small haul and it is from good old beauty bay I love beauty bay I I get a lot of my makeup from there um, there's high-end, there's a uh, drugstore, there's hair, there's makeup, there's skincare, which is what I got. <laughs> there's all sorts, so definitely it's over here in England, especially if you want the American brands, definitely go check them out. This is not sponsored in any way. This is stuff I have bought with my own money. So, to see, it comes in the typical Beauty Bay box. Uh, it's a small one because it is a small package. And open this. From there, I was gonna open with that, but just, ah! while I'm trying to do that, who's been enjoying this weather over here? I'm sweating right now because I've got lights on either side and <laughs> my heating was on for some reason. I don't want this weather to end. Oh, I love the hot weather. So, yeah, I think I'm gonna have to open it this way. So, I've got the diamonds. And they are all in here by the looks of it. Just that. Just that if I need a return. So before I get started, one of the massive things that I've been wanting to get more into um, is skincare. I've used to take care of my skin so much. Like I used to love my skin. Um, and then I kind of neglected it. So leaving the makeup on, which is a big no-no. Uh, not doing toners and I, I moisturize every day and night because I have dry skin. So I went online and done a bit of research and I wanted to try out some products I have never tried before. Now, one brand that I've been dying to try is The Ordinary. And on Beauty Bay, go on there and they have like all sorts. You have to really like research what they do to make sure, yeah, it's okay to use this product, this product, and it's all right for your skin. And yeah, so I got two products from that. And the first product I got was Lactic Acid 5% plus HA. And it's quite a small, I didn't know what to expect. I'm not like, I don't know anyone that uses it. So I didn't know if it would be a big bottle, small bottle. So I'm not disappointed. <laughs> it does say 30 mils in there. And with the lactic acid it has AHA and hyaluronic acid and it is it visibly targets uneven tones textural irregulations and fine lines which I'm getting older <laughs> I'm getting those lines I want to stop it before it goes too far and I also if you can tell you probably can because I know when I've watched back I'm like my texture on my face open it up it is quite a decent bottle. So that's the lac lac lactic acid. The lactic acid is a mild exfoliator for your skin, so a liquid exfoliator, and it targets, like I said, the uneven tones, the texturals, and the fine lines, um, and it exfoliates with only 5% concentrate, as it says. It's lightweight serum. It reduces any inflammations and redness on the skin and sensitivity. It does cause enhancing of sensitivity to light, so oh, what I read was to do this at night and then in the morning put a sunscreen on as well. So you can dilute it with any other treatment, it says. Yeah, and use it for a couple days and weeks to see how it works. So I'm excited to try that one. That's the bottle. And it's a little dropper. I'm gonna sound weird, but it smells like Sprite. Yeah, it definitely smells like Sprite. That's weird. Let's see if it. Put a bit on my skin and see how it feels. 
Now it doesn't feel rough at all. So it's supposed to be exfoliator. I was expecting like a liquid gradient almost. My skin feels soft though. It doesn't say that you take it off or anything. Yeah, so I guess you keep it on overnight as well. The second one I got is what I'm really, really excited about. Now, along with the texture of my skin that I've been really disappointed about, one massive thing is I'm worried about the sagging skin. I'm worried about the lines. I'm not saying I'm old, old at all, but it's never too early to start with anti-aging care. So this I had, I've seen so many amazing reviews on. Um, I've seen people online say that how it really dramatically reduced the fine lines, really tightened their skin, blurred imperfections quite well. I'm really excited to try this and I got the Ordinary Buffet Serum. So it visibly targets surface hydration, fine lines, wrinkles, dynamic lines, and textural regulations. <laughs> Don't kill me for saying that wrong. Yeah, another thing, it will help as well with the texture and the lines, I'm hoping. Let me know down below, actually, if you want to see the results from these products. It is only two of them. I do want to go down the line if these work quite well and try more. So let me know down in the comments if you want to see that. Again, it's in a little dropper bottle. And this, I know you keep on your skin, so it's just like a serum on your face as well and you can put it on AM and PM. So it's specifically designed to stimulate collagen in your face, which when you get older, collagen leaves. Yeah, that's why you start sagging a bit. Y'all know that. And it also helps with repairing the skin. So sun damage, the age, the fact that I went so many days not taking my makeup off until I wake up and I'm like, oh crap, let's try it over again. So I know you can relate to that. It also tracks a thousand percent as weight in water, so I guess it helps with the hydration as well. The peptides in this help send a message to your skin that it's losing collagen, like I said, and it starts to kick in the renewal of your skin. I'll try this and you know, see what it smells like. So you know me. It definitely smells weird. It's a little dropper as well. Definitely smells like just serums. And that feels really nice. The smell is not there anymore, but that really feels nice. It helps with breakouts as well, it claims. And I will be trying that out as well. And last but not least, one thing I needed to get was a new cleanser. I have the Rose one that you could get in Superdrug, in the big pink bottle. It's cream and I feel all oily and it's just, I don't know there's something about it like it takes off the makeup but not to a great extent don't feel like my face is always clean I literally feel like I have to do it like three times before I know right well, that's off then do the exfoliator and all this so I wanted an actual cleansing soap thing so I feel like it actually give my skin a good wash so Korean skincare is something I've wanted to get into as well um, so this will be my first proper no, it's not. I had the foaming face mask before, so that was a lie. <laughs> but I got the Holika Holika Firming Citron Daily Wash. It is a cleanser, so it's a cleansing foam. It helps with the firming of skin. See what I mean? I'm, I must seem like I'm old, old, but I'm not. I just, I want to take care of it so it does not get to that point. It contains a citron seed oil, makes tired skin elastic and revitalized. Take a smell that. Oh, there's something on there. At least I know it's not been open. And there's something else in there. I have to smell the products. I have to. When I first get them. But that's the problem with buying online. You don't smell it before you buy. So sometimes, like, I get something and it doesn't smell great. Oh, I got my lipstick on there. There's just a white little cream. Put it on there. Okay, so what's the directions? Okay, so put a bit in your dry palm, lather, add a bit of water, rub the face, and wash it off. Just normal face wash, basically. <laughs> but I'm excited to try it. I have seen good reviews on it. I did want to go something that people actually got something from. 
I do need to take better care of my skin. One massive tip is drink a lot of water. Where things just went for me. <laughs> water went out the window, soda came into my life again. I've never been a massive soda drinker either. And that's messed up my face, my skin, my body. You know. So yeah, that is my little mini beauty bay haul. Skincare. And if you've tried any of these products, please let me know. How did you find them? Did you get on with them? Did they make a massive difference in your skin? Are they your go-tos now? Especially, I want to know about the buffet one. Because I'm dying to try that. I'm excited to see what happens. And as well, again, leave down below a comment if you want me to do a update skincare routine thing. <laughs> see if it's actually working. Uh, if it's not, if it's a big... So yeah, that is it, and I can't thank you enough for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. Please hit that subscription button down below so you don't miss any one of my videos. Please hit the thumbs up button if you've enjoyed it. It would mean a lot to me, and I'd love to talk to you more. I like answering back to all your questions, or if you have any suggestions, just leave a comment, and I will be back with you. So until next time, have a good one.